All right, let's go over some exercises that we can add to our daily routine um, that can help us in our sprinting, really supplemental-wise. Um, let's focus on uh, three muscles. The first one is going to be the anterior tibialis. That's going to be the muscle on the front of the shin, um, primarily responsible for ankle dorsiflexion. The um, reason this is so important is it can help us uh, stabilize the ankle upon uh, ground contact. Um, it's also going to help us pull that toe up, which is going to expose the ball of the foot. So when we do make contact with the ground, um, we have a better opportunity for uh, that spring action, that pogo-like action, and better ground contacts, which should yield faster times. Uh, the next one we'll go to is uh, the gastroc. Um, that's just your calf muscle, primarily responsible for ankle plantar flexion. Um, but really, we want to train this in a sense to resist any excess dorsiflexion when we make contact with the ground. Uh, we just want to you know, think of Achilles stiffness. We want to have a stiff Achilles when we make contact with the ground um, so we get that rigid impact um, where we don't collapse and leak all that energy into the ground. Um, and then from there, we'll move on to the soleus. Now the soleus is a pretty underappreciated muscle. Um, it often gets neglected. It's, it gets activated when the, when the knee is in flexion. So as you see it in a deeper squat here, kind of doing some calf raises. Um, this also aids um, in ankle plantar flexion, uh, but I want to think of it in the sense of resisting excess ankle dorsiflexion. Um, this is pound for pound one of the strongest muscles in the body. Um, but is often, like I said, neglected when it comes to strength training. Um, and, and the different ways we can go attack, and, and really all of these muscle groups, um, is we can do it in the traditional, um, what you think of traditional reps, um, but we can also do it in isometric. Isometrics will yield um, a ton of results for you. They're relatively easy to do, and you can do them anywhere without any level of equipment. Um, so give these a try and see how they help your sprints going forward.